Today we're reviewing the high-speed train from Amsterdam to Paris. Get your tickets early and pay attention to the seat layout. You can get four seats together in a booth if you're really careful when you make a purchase. Are we late? Uh, uh, very. Very late. Our train was late and the train operators have a refund policy if the train is a little late. So read that, it may come in handy. We left from the Amsterdam Central Station. Try to be at the right gate and remember the high-speed train is red. It is red. Very red. <laughs> Boarding the train is a little bit chaotic. As you board, you will need to stow your large bags on the baggage area. You can walk through this area as you get to your seat. You can also carry on your backpacks to your seat. Yes, there's plenty of room above it. If someone misses the train, they are allowed to ride on the next available in the baggage area. That made me uneasy watching people standing by our bags the whole trip but it was okay, just weird. I loved the scenery as we crossed Belgium and into the French countryside. It was beautiful. The trucks run alongside the interstate. It was fun looking at how fast we were going compared to the people on the interstate. Right, if G had a speed tracker on his phone and it registered a top speed of 181 miles per hour. We, we were humming. The train ride takes three hours and 20 minutes to get to Paris. The train stops at Schiphol Airport, Rotterdam, Antwerp, and Brussels. Arrival in the French capital is at Paris Nord Station. And it was beautiful. It was. The bathroom facilities were nice and clean on the train. You can get food on the train if you like, or you can bring it on with you as you board. That's right, you had an Apple experience that was interesting. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you would think this says apples and cheese. <laughs> so what are your thoughts on the train? I enjoyed the train. I would definitely suggest if you're taking the train, pack as lightly as possible. That's right. All that luggage, you're carrying it on the train. And you know, we've been there for over a week already, but we got on the train. So of course we had a lot of luggage and it was heavy. You gotta deal with it all the train. Yeah, you gotta deal with it. You're your own baggage person. So as long as you can handle that, the rest of it was wonderful. It really neat. I really enjoyed it. Uh, we had the four seaters. We had four people with us and that let us have conversations. We were able to get photographs. If you want to see what else went on on our European trip, watch this playlist. We'll see you here next time on Mamie and G.